This is most likely going to be a wasted video. I can barely get it even to focus this dark. Uh, technically the tide should still be rising. Uh, there wasn't much water coming out of this manhole where you can... Oh, there it is, right there. Whoa, look at that. Wow. Oh my goodness. That's That was worth waiting for. Whoa, 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 whoa. Nice. No, 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 it's been, uh, it's, uh, I mean, it's been coming up for about an hour. I mean, uh, this is the, because the king tides. Oh, it's because of the tides. Yeah, it's the tides. See, every once in a while it blows out of that manhole. It's almost, it's almost popping the cover off. Oh, wow. Yeah, it was, it's, it's pretty cool. I, I mean, I, it does that uh, everywhere that we have a low spot like this. Yeah. When the sea is high, it, it comes up to the drains, except in Miami Beach, because they got manual pumps shoving it back out. But, but here, I've never seen that before. Like, I've seen it. Where, like, lift the, the whole manhole. Yeah, I think it's because it's having a little problem between the pressure from other drains and then the pressure from the sea and somehow because it was putting out water steady like that. That's normal for the manholes to do that when the tide is high. But I've never seen it like stop and then blow up and then stop like that. It is, it is. And that last time it did it, it really, really shot out for a while. Like, I just saw like, this is like up in the air. But exactly. Exactly. Usually it'll stop for a few seconds and then it'll kind of blow up for like a half a second. But that actually like sustained like was, was flying out. It was almost enough to actually move the cover off the hole. Well, that would be really cool if that happened. Have a good night. Oh man, I wish there was better light for that. I mean, I guess I've seen a little bit of variation. But man, the way that really just went, just stayed flying up. That's better than what I missed. Recording. The other times it just it would, I noticed it, you know, I've been standing here for quite a while. And I, just, I, I didn't even see the manhole, I forgot about it. And I just saw a little bit of water coming across the road. And I was like, oh yeah, I haven't looked at the manhole to see if it's coming out of that. Because the manhole level, it always seems to come out of the manholes at a higher level than it does out of there. As big as those drains are, you think if there was enough pressure to do this, that, the, that those drains would already have the water up to here. It's interesting how much more pressure there is in the manholes than there is in the street, the curbside gutters. But anyway, so it would stop and then it kind of, you know, a little bit. But the one, the one that I caught, hopefully, that was better than the ones I missed. So that, that's pretty cool. I haven't seen that yet. That, don't, that was really lifting that up. And uh, it, it seems like it landed right down where it's supposed to. It's not offset any. It's right about where it's supposed to be. So, oh, I wish... And of all places, there could be a little dark spot right here. I might as well have a bag of liquor. It's so dark in this one little spot. Right in the middle of Brickle. The heart of Brickle. Oh, man. But what I think it is, maybe, and this is, you know, speculation, the, the fact that it, uh, the, it's like it's a different system. This is a, a manhole to a sewer. The curbside gutters have to be different somehow it can't just be one giant vat down there obviously it's not like anything like that especially in this town if anything it's underbuilt um but anyway uh the the amount of uh aperture there is from the curbside gutters you would think that as, as easily as the water comes out of there with no apparent pressure visible if there's enough pressure somehow in these wherever the manholes connect to that is pushing the water up through with pressure at a higher elevation than the, than the water is down there. It's interesting, I guess. And there are other manholes, such as in the street, that are about the same level that aren't doing this. It's coming out with more and more pressure now. Salt water though. Salt water though, that's what these drivers don't know. Yeah. And I don't see it in this gutter, although the first time I real I recognized the spot, I swear I saw it gush out of this gutter, kind of like a burp. Basically the same as what the manhole did. And I really thought when I saw it stop for how long it stopped for. 
I thought for somehow the tide was going down early, even though it's only about a quarter after 11. This tide should be, I don't know, 11.30 midnight. It's got to be, this is a late one for sure. But it's not, and I thought it was lowering over there, but it's not. So, and this is not, according to the trajectory of what the past few tides have been doing, they've been dying down since Sunday. This is a decent amount of water for being several days past the peak. 